Hi, welcome to MHCC. I'm Owen, and we're about to go interview Greg. We're gonna be. Hey. Hey. So, uh, here we're getting 23 new Quick Start students tomorrow. Yes. Are, aren't we already at max capacity? No, we're not. What, what is the capacity? Well, um, the capacity has not yet uh, been reached in that we still have room for students in classes and then last year, last spring, we actually sat aside money for productivity to pay teachers to teach during their prep uh -huh. period. So um, we're approaching that, yes we are, <laughs> and when we're there, we're, we're there. All right. Well, I have heard that there are some classes that are being overflown, like overflowing with students right now. There are some classes that are full. That's absolutely correct. And that's the reason why we have productivity money set aside. Okay. Uh-huh. Right. Yeah, we, we want to, uh, of course, preserve the awesome things that we have going on here at Mountain High School, what we have to offer and our resources and our staff. Um, for the benefit of our students while at the same time um, serving as many kids as we can. So think of it as Central Park in New York City. Uh, we, we will maintain um, Central Park and not allow it to be concreted over, but yet we also want to allow people to enjoy the park, so to speak, to use that analogy. Make sense? Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. All right. I appreciate your questions. Yep. Thank you, Greg. Thank you. Go Mountain. Go Mountain. Um, just give us a quick rundown about what's going on right now. Okay, well, um, today is our day of service. Uh, looks a little chaotic right now, but um, Sherry from Youth Futures just finished talking to us a little bit about the shelter that they have. Um, it's a youth future, or it's, <laughs> it's a youth shelter, sorry. And um, so we just learned about it. We're going to be putting together some welcome kits. Every teen who goes to their shelter gets a welcome kit. So right now, everyone's just organizing all the stuff that goes into the kits. Then we'll start putting the kits together. We're going to stack them on the stage so we can see how nice it all looks. And then in the library, they're going to be tying fleece blankets to donate, too. That's what's going down. Yay! Go Mountain! <laughs> Hello! I think it's going great. We got, uh, I think, uh, 65 kits put together in less than an hour, and we're halfway through with the fleece, so you guys are killing it. I am very happy this is happening. I, Mountain High is one of my favorite places to visit. <laughs> Go Mountain! Hey, I'm fleeced! You're, now I'm tying knots, so it makes it fringy and so cute. Look, I'll show you how to tie a knot. You just go like this, and then you pull tight, and it creates just a fun little fringe. It'll tickle your nose when you're all cozy. <laughs> this is not a quilt. It's a blanket. It's a fleece blanket. You think it's straight fleece in? Straight fleece in. I'm part of the I'm part of the fleece well, friends. <laughs> the fleece the fleece fellas. The fleece fellas. I don't know. She's asking if we can do that. And then look at Tyler's. This this is what's gonna win him best hair at Mountain High School in the yearbook. Best hair at Mountain High. Medusa. Oh yeah? Medusa. Jamie, oh, yeah. do you think Tyler's gonna win best hair? What? Do you think Tyler's gonna win best hair award? Yeah. How could I not? Go <laughs> around. Look at that. What an amazing hairpiece. Was this worth all the pennies that you stole from your grandkids? Oh, absolutely. You know, my grandkids are still hungry, but they'll if they only knew what good was going on, they'd be happy. They'd eat their little goldfish contentedly. Bene, how does it feel to be a trash man? Well, you know, that's what I do before teaching. I work in the trash can. It's going good! <laughs> Hooray! What's your opinion on this? I love, I love it. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Good job. So in 
update, we had enough students show up today that we made 60 welcome kits way faster than we thought. So now we're turning station one into station two, and now we have two station twos. So everybody's gonna be time fleece blankets right now. And it's awesome, because we're gonna get everything done. We still have like a whole hour. Do you think we'll finish before? Oh, I think we'll finish. Then what's the plan afterward? Oh, I think we'll finish by the time school's done. That's what I mean. If we finish that? too soon, then we all take a nap with our new blankets. Just kidding, we'll they're not for them. us. Ooh, test drive them, that's a good <laughs> idea. <laughs> Oh, hi. I'm just looking at the Mountain High yearbook. Right now, they're on sale for $20. Soon, they'll be $25. You should go get one from Joy in the main office. They're also on My Guardian DSD. We also passed out a yearbook survey and advisory. Hand it to Kiefer when you're done, or turn it into Kiefer when you're done. Go, Mountain. Go get a yearbook. I'm Patrick with MHS TV. Y'all have a great weekend and get ready for Mini Tune Ford. Go Maui! We got a number one victory royale. Yeah, Fortnite, we about to get down. get down. Ten kills on the board right now. Just wiped out Tomato Town. My friend just gone down. I revived him, now we're heading southbound. Now we're in the Pleasant Park streets. Look at the map, go to the mark sheet. Take me to your Xbox to play Fortnite today. You can check me with Steve Meyer. But not Loot Lake, I really love to chug chug with you. We can be pro Fortnite gamers. He said, hey broski, you got some heals in the shield pot? I need healing and I am only at 1 HP. Hey dude, sorry, I found nothing on this safari. I checked the upstairs of that house, but not the underneath yet.